Hi, in the next few minutes, we're going to take a look at some what's new highlights in this UFT1 release. First, let's take a look at some AI-based features as AI-based testing continues to evolve. Install the remote AI service on one central computer with a strong GPU card to provide faster and more efficient AI capabilities to less powerful UFT1 machines. UFT1 uses AI models to identify controls. If a new model becomes available, you will be prompted to update your AI model to improve test performance and accuracy. When using AI identification, you can now automatically add set context steps. Edit the details of a step before adding it. Run the step you create on the application and more. You can now use table and calendar controls as containers or parent objects. Using an object hierarchy can improve your test's readability and resilience. You can now use AI-based testing on multilingual applications and identify new types of controls. Next up, a new PDF add-in which no longer relies on Adobe Acrobat Pro. Open your PDF document from within UFT using the PDF testing utility. Then you can test the PDF document using the same steps as before. When running parallel tests, you can now use a new user interface to configure the runs instead of manually preparing a complicated JSON file. In addition to API, web, and mobile tests, you can now run Java tests in parallel. To get the latest updates when integrating with your CI CD servers, use the latest plugin and extension versions. For example, when working with Azure DevOps, you now get more detailed run result reports. If you want to integrate UFT1 with a CI server that does not have a dedicated UFT1 plugin, Use these new utilities to launch UFT1, run tests, and generate reports. This UFT1 release includes support for new versions of Chrome, Chromium Edge, and Firefox, and new AutoPass license server versions. It also adds support for over 30 new technology versions, including Angular, DevExpress, Java, Oracle, SAP, and many more. To learn more, check out the UFT1 Help Center and become a part of the MicroFocus UFT1 community. Enjoy the new UFT1 2021 release. Mm -hmm.